So this is my first real print that I got from Thingiverse.com. Uh, you easily download. They got all kinds of cool stuff. I finally updated my machine to Windows 7 because uh, the DaVinci did not support Vista. Also built a nice uh, stand for the, the, the printer, as you can see on the left side. So the device you see I'm playing with is um, an attachment for, they called it a sound deflector, like a sound amplifier for your iPhone. And it usually works better with the case, as you can see I have a, a case inside. It's not the best design, but um, I just needed something quick to to test it out once since I can play with it more I'll, I'll be posting more videos of other uh, projects so I was very impressed with the quality of the print um, the setting was at 0.3 millimeters and it did a really good job printing it there's this black piece over here that looks like a burnt uh, material that kind of got stuck on but that's fine uh, overall the quality was really good um, very nice turn out. Uh, it was printed in this upwards position so I was kind of curious to see what would happen over there in the bottom. Well, on the opposite end basically. So the bottom of the top section looks actually pretty good. I mean there are some loose kind of pieces that I used a screwdriver to, to, to take it off to make it a better finish but you don't necessarily have to do that. So this is what it looks like after I cleaned it up a little bit. Uh, I mean, again, it's not a critical area, so I just left it the way it was. Um, it, the print basically took about 50 minutes to print. That's including the heating time, and uh, again, it turned out really good. And uh, so, if you have any other recommendations or suggestions, uh, feel free to comment below, and uh, don't forget to subscribe.